guys, it is Wednesday, day 128 of quarantine. Welcome back to the weekly quarantine vlog. Nick is actually leaving me today for the second time since quarantine. The first time he just went to his friend's house down the road, but today he is going to his first band practice since all of this happened and I think he's super excited so I just said goodbye to him he's in the car right now getting ready to go so I'm about to close up the office so I can head out to the living room make some dinner and I can just chill for tonight but it's like bittersweet I'm very happy for him though I'm super excited that things are getting back to normal um so yeah I just wanted to start the vlog there because I'm watching him leave as we speak huge moment all right I have stroganoff for dinner ice water bun is out eat his dinner. I'm gonna play some Animal Crossing, catch up on some vlogs, and that is a perfect night to myself. I'd say so myself. I'm so excited. Um, Stroganoff is really good by the way. It's homemade and it's like low, I don't want to say low calorie, but it's like Weight Watcher conscious. But this way, it's only three points for a cup of this, which is pretty cool. Anyways, I want to dive into dinner, watch some vlogs, and get into Animal Crossing. Alright, so I figured I would show you just a little bit of what I've done to my island before I film that big video of my island rehaul. So I'm just logging in for the day, so I didn't clean up anything, so I got fossils and weeds probably everywhere. But let me show you what I got. I think, I'm not sure if I showed you this last time, but I made a little lavender garden in here. thought it was pretty cute. And this is where I store my turnips when I buy them, which I didn't buy any this week. You come over here and it's open. Right now it's hosting my flowers. I'm not sure what to do with all the white flowers. And I'm not sure what to do with all the pink flowers, but um, red is over there. His little private beach. And then you come across here. Hold on, I gotta shut the AC off. Okay, you come across here. There's another little cliff area. I think I like this. It's gonna stay like this for a little bit. Um, maybe I'll do a pool next, but it's just a little like boardwalk with a restaurant at the uh, end of it. I thought it was kind of cute. You can sit down. The tables, I think it's cute. Uh, this is my campground. Hasn't changed much since I've flattened it. Actually, I don't think it's changed at all. I still have 4,000 flowers on my beach that I'm trying to get rid of. Um, it's taking longer than I wanted, but up here in the back, this is where I'm storing, oh, somebody lost something. This is where I'm putting all my flowers, um, except for the white and pink ones. I ran out of room to do that. But this is one of my favorite areas because when you sit here, you have the beautiful view of the back. I think that's absolutely gorgeous. So yeah, this is where all my flowers are at. Loving the way that looks. We come down here. And we'll go back across, and then that's my house where we started. And then down over here, this is just like lined. That's Cranston. Hi, Cranston. Lined with different villagers. I think there's five on this side, five on the other side. A little seating area. Oh, love these little ducks, by the way, too. So cute. And then that's basically what it is like on the other side as well. I do have a little phone box. I wish I had a red one. And a sitting area over here as well. And then you come around here. This is my orchard i just did this i wanted 10 trees of each fruit but i didn't have the room so i just made these little little area of trees which i thought was like so stinking cute obsessed with this um and then you come over here and it's like a book club area so you go up through the back which i don't know why i had that in the back i think it was because i just didn't have room in the front but you come up around here and you go up here and you got a little book club area which I also think it's super cute. So when you come back down and you go across, this is where my entrance is. This is, oh, let me get it down like that. So yeah, this is where what my entrance looks like and I absolutely love it. I think it looks so beautiful in the sky tonight. My island looks amazing. But what I did is I put a little bird bath, a little barrel, and then over here the suitcase is there. And it's just basically like a, I don't know, like the entrance of a train station or it's right in front of the airport. So I think... I love that a lot. And then you come around here, it looks pretty much the same as the other side. There's houses over there. A little, um, I know this person really likes to play with me anyways. Um, and you come over here and you're back into the town center and oh, I'm so happy I need to buy more bushes from him so I'm happy. Leaf is there today. Got a little, uh, stand, newspaper stand. And then everything is the same over here. I might have shown you this already, but this is my town center. So I got a flower place, I got nooks, pizza place, the tailor shop, and then I'm trying to figure out what I want to put here. There was a pottery place, but I didn't like it that much. And then this is my museum. And it's super simple. I like it. Don't need anything extravagant, really. And then this is where a bunch of benches and seating areas. I gotta fill this in a little bit more. I gotta put a bench right here and move the trees around a little bit. But I'm also gonna put um, water where these flowers are. I'm not sure where to store all the extra flowers. I wish I had a little more land. But yeah, that's basically what I've been up to on my island. All right, that's finally over with. I hope it doesn't start again because I'm not in the mood for that tonight. Um, 
yeah, fingers crossed. That doesn't happen again. By the way, I should mention that I'm pretty sure that they just do testing sporadically. I just wish that they told us when they were doing testing because every so often it does just go off for no reason. There's no fire in the apartment complex. We're fine. <laughs> Morning. Today is Friday. It's day 130 and I just wanted to say good morning. Also wanted to talk about the new Taylor Swift album that randomly dropped the other day. I did listen to it and I think it's better than the last album that she released, in my opinion. Um, I think it's more back to her roots or from when I did like her. But with that being said, it's still not my favorite. I mean, it's good. Don't get me wrong. Like, I would listen to it, but... I think that maybe I've moved on from the T-Swift era. But yeah, that's just my thoughts on it. I know a lot of people are going crazy over it and are obsessed with it. I still think it's really good. Like, don't get me wrong. Please don't come at me. And it's a lot better than the last album. I'll just say that. I don't really know what else to say. I just wanted to say my thoughts on the new T-Swift album because that's a hot topic right now. Um... What time is it? 9.19. I get to eat breakfast around 9.45, 10 o'clock. So I'm going to go in the office, and answer some emails, come out and make some breakfast, head back and do some work, and then probably some Animal Crossing uh, before heading over to Nick's parents' house because today is his dad's birthday. We are social distancing. Don't worry, we'll be wearing masks. We're staying six feet away. Um, but we are doing a little cookout, little burgers and dogs and cake and stuff um, just to celebrate his birthday because it's hard having a birthday during quarantine. Well, I don't personally know, but I've been to some like birthday parades and social distancing parties, so I can assume that it is difficult. And it's difficult to plan a, a birthday because my 30th is in October, but that's a different story. Okay, I'm rambling. We'll see you later. I haven't done my hair yet. It's still a hot mess. But speaking of hair, Nick is cutting off his quarantine beard because he lost all his beard um, masks because then he wants to wear a regular mask because we're going to go over to his parents' house. You're just going for it, huh? Could be worse, right? <laughs> Digging right in. <laughs> he didn't get to show me before he did it. I was like, let me vlog it. He's you like, know what I look like. Yeah, but I wanted to see how big it was because it was actually massive. Look at the photo. Fine, we'll insert a photo here. And then I'll show you what it looks like afterward. Because he's cutting it all. Cut it off. Hey. What's his new beard? Huh? <laughs> you tell him that the thing ran out on you in the middle yeah. of it. I think it was dead and he put it on the charger and it still didn't work but then after like 10 minutes it started to work he's like I don't have time to finish it because we're trying to get it over to his parents house for 6 o'clock and it's 6, I mean it's 5.50 and they live 15 minutes away and we still go to the store so he's like I'll just do it later but he's back to his short beard. I haven't seen him like that in a while since the beginning of quarantine because he's been growing this out since we've been in here. Nick just bought my birthday present on the way over here. That's right. <laughs> we're in the enchanted forest and there's a dog. Okay, so we're at the party. Big crowd, huh? We're so small. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like everyone. I didn't know there's gonna be more people, but apparently there is. But everyone's inside right now, ignoring the social distancing thing that we gotta do. But we're responsible, and we have our masks. No one's out here, so we don't have them on right now. What am I doing here? Yeah, with my keys. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> How did I get here? Yeah. Happy birthday, princess. <laughs> You're pretty, princess. <laughs> If you want to be, you're pretty good. Okay. <laughs> this is your day. <laughs> you see the card? Happy birthday, you, princess. You, you got the same color on. Look. Yeah. That's <laughs> just for you. <laughs> there you go. Wow, dig in there, Pop. Happy birthday. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. you. Blow it out. Yeah, many more. Blow it out. Yeah, blow your blow candle. Blow it out. Here comes my killer candle. Blow it out. Right under the Get a blow the candle out. <laughs> blow the candle out. Blow it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yay. This no is wonder, nothing new. No wonder How I'm many times have you done this? <laughs> Nick's just being a cat whisperer. <laughs> she looks so cute. She reminds me of one of our old cats named Roxy. Not mine and Nick's, but my family's. Oh, look at her. Hi, honey. And Louie got a new collar. You look so handsome. Think you got a hair. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. What a night. See you in the morning. My mama told me I should be where I'll tell you a story about me. People who take you so innocent girls. Don't mean to scare you, but be careful Maybe think twice before you walk along Call somebody to take you home Look over your shoulder when you go that way This world might 
take you to a bad, bad place. Welcome to the vlog. Today is, what's today? Saturday. Saturday. Never sure what day of the week it is, but, I and I don't even know what day of quarantine it is, but anyways, we are out with our friends. We're at Chatham Beach right now. We kind of saw a little montage of what we've been up to at Chatham Pier. Now we're at Chatham Beach, and yeah, we're just hanging out, having fun. We're gonna go to Main Street later. We got our mask on, and it's a beautiful day. If you're wondering, there are sharks on the Cape, and they have these signs at the beaches that have them, which is most beach, but Chatham Lighthouse Beach definitely has sharks. vlog so far <laughs> we kind of are just going at it there is no plan last minute knew that they were coming here but this is the first time we are driving with the roof off the jeep what it's really exciting though it's such a nice day yeah it is <laughs> um i guess the plan from here is they're grabbing some drinks we're getting ice we're gonna put it in the cooler and we're gonna grab chairs and then we're gonna go to a place called susu at harbor to grab some laps the rolls and then we're gonna bring dinner to probably mayflower beach because they have a bathroom and we're gonna sit out during low tide watch the sunset the tide go out and just kind of chill and relax i think it sounds like a perfect night i haven't been to the beach at all this summer like not even once and I'm usually at the beach twice a week so it's been very strange not being there or even having a sticker at that back so but yeah that's the plan hope you're enjoying this little Cape Cod this little view of where we live pretty cool <laughs> in the summer hi bunnies you're so little compared to Mr. Blake are you guys together are you guys siblings <laughs> So we're at Mayflower Beach and as you saw, it's absolutely crazy. There's like a thousand people here, which I have never seen, only during the day. But we're eating Susu Harbor Cafe right now. It's in my lap and it's amazing. Oh my gosh. This is beautiful, baby. Yeah, but they can't see it. They can't see it. Do you wanna, do you wanna see it? <laughs> nice and blurry because what else would my camera do? The first sound you hear be a beating heart It's beating bright, it's beating bold mm. When your eyes come to me, I'm humbled constantly A supernova in sight mm. Hey 
Hey guys, it's Wednesday morning and I'm just popping on real quick to end the vlog for this week because I never remember to do it on a Tuesday. Anyways, with all that being said, thank you guys so much for watching this week. If you haven't yet, can you please subscribe to my channel, hit that thumbs up button, or leave a comment in the comment section because that would mean the absolute world to me. I'm going to start next week's vlog right now, so I will see you next week. Okay, bye!